in order to measure elbow active range of motion from extension to flexion, the patient can be seated or they could be standing. The arm is simply held at the side with um, the forearm in full supination. The goniometer is placed on the lateral surface of the arm. The axis of the goniometer is placed right over the lateral epicondyle. The stationary arm of the goniometer is lined up with the humeral head, which in this case is not directly vertical. All right. Uh, and the moving arm of the goniometer is lined up with the radial styloid. Right there. All right. So that's our starting position. Can you straighten your elbow out any farther? Okay. And in this case, we can get just to zero. All right. Now, can you holding that forearm position bring your arm up? Yep. All the way up, far as it'll go. Okay. And we don't need to get there. We go. Perfect. Then you can repalpate, find that lateral epicondyle again. All right. Find that head of the humerus again for the stationary arm, right about there. And find that radial styloid again. And in this case, we have about 0 to 140 degrees of elbow flexion.